So I heard that Clint has been revamped. You already know what that means. Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be using the new revamp Clint. And to my surprise, his damage output now is absolutely inconceivable. You guys see what I did there? I'm expanding my vocabulary. Anyway, throughout this gameplay, you'll be able to see how much better he is after a revamp. Welcome to Mobile Legends. So in this game, I decided to play Clint as the hyper carry, but this is definitely really risky. Because when you get stunned, you are pretty much dead. So your positioning has to be impeccable. Now his first skill deals way more damage than before. And it is a lot more useful during a team fight and clearing the minion wave as well. You can clearly see already how much stronger and better clean this after a revamp. Also, if you end up enjoying this video, consider leaving a like and subscribing to the channel. Smiley face. Instead of going back to base, I saw that the bottom lane small camp is still available. And when you have the jungle item, this jungle monster will heal most of your HP. I have been too greedy lately. Whenever I see that there's an opportunity to gain free gold from their turrets, I use tunnel vision and forget about the map awareness and whatnot. Actually, I did this on purpose so you guys can see firsthand what will happen to you if you let your greediness blind you. Yup. It's already almost minute 4 and Johnson still doesn't have his ult. He's making a rookie mistake here by trying to help me clear the jungle. But in fact, he should be clearing the middle lane while I'm jungling so he can at least have his ultimate. Johnson is pinging to attack, we should keep chasing. Drop your weapon in hand. 
By the way, clean second skill can help you go through walls, but only very thin walls. It doesn't work with the thick ones. Angel is going to use the ultimate secret technique. I will force you to fight no jutsu. Honestly, not sure why did she ult me so early, when nothing was really happening. After looking at the map, I knew it was a really bad idea to engage them right now. We are way outnumbered. I guess Cyclops is quite upset that I haven't played him for quite a while. Understandable. It's too late for me to do anything in the top lane. So I decided to use this chance to push their middle lane instead. They got me cornered. But little did I know, I still had under my sleeve the reverse Uno card. And with Angela ultimate, now I feel invincible. I can kill every single one of them. This Johnson is going to sacrifice his life in order to last hit their middle turret. What an honorable death. Looking at the map, the enemies are too close. They will definitely come top to help Hilda. Tigra and Kagura are trying to flank us, I need to wait for the right timing to engage, because if they see me, they will try to kill me first. Remember, when you are playing the carry role, they will always try to kill you first. So knowing that, I anticipated Tigra next move, or also known as one step ahead no jutsu. Know your enemy and know yourself, and you can fight a hundred battles without disaster. Absolutely insane this damage. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, consider leaving a like and subscribing. Thanks. Clint.